Oh man, put up no! Yeah! We're going to Hook and Grill. It just opened up not too long ago. How do you eat there? There's no such thing as plates. They put all of your picks in a bag, so they do all seafood. All what are you seafood. talking about? That's not, what? That's yes. crazy. Yep. Well, I guess so. We're I guess so. We're gonna get so. nice and messy. No forks either, so all hands, <laughs> dig it on in. So it looks like you pick your catch, which they have uh, several options of. Some of them are no prices listed. Yeah, because you know it's what like that market means. price, which is probably gonna be so expensive. It's pretty much seafood. So you know, you got stuff ranging from blue crab to mussels, clams, and uh, shrimp. Lobster. The lobster too. Yeah, I know you really <laughs> love lobster in New England. I'm not a fan, to be honest with you. I know, don't kill me. Next, you pick your sauce, and then you've got six to choose from. You've got original Cajun, that's me. I like original occasion. We no, have you garlic don't. Butter. No, you don't. You like garlic butter. I, like I was pointing at you, so you picked the next one. Okay. Lemon pepper. <laughs> Plain. Dry. I guess this is like a dry rub. And then the hook and reel special blend. Mm. Then you pick which spice level you want. They have mild, spicy, and fire. Reasonable enough, I guess. And you've got extras like corn on the cob, Cajun fries, whatever. There's sweet Ooh. potato fries. Cajun fries. And that's basically it. I guess they just put it in a bag, they mix it all up, and uh, they Give serve it. To it you and you eat it. Yeah. I've never tried anything like this before. I think this is kind of like down south vibe. Yeah. Like Louisiana, you know? It looks quite expensive. Oh, look at this. They've got like a bunch of like yeah. other appetizers Fish, too. Fish, po' boys. Ah, oh, they yeah, got they sandwiches. Have they have wings, salads. Crab baskets. Crab sliders. cake baskets. Okay. Soups and salads. So uh, I guess you don't just have to go with the main attraction, which is, you know, the bag. I'll call it a grab bag. So yeah, we're headed over there now. It's at what, Bell, what's that place called? Bell Circle? What's Wonderland? It's near, I don't know what the circle's called. No, Wonderland Circle? Wonderland Circle, let's call it. <laughs> where Staples used to be, they used to have a stop and shop there. It, it's like in the place of the stop and shop. Yeah. So, you know, you can take the blue line there or one of the buses, I think like the 455 or something like that, if you're not driving. But there are plenty of parking if you are driving. And we're out of here. It looks pretty big. It actually looks like a throw up bucket. We could fit you in there. <laughs> your catch we're gonna get the blue crab and we're going with the hook and reel special sauce mm, mm, mm. Real sauce, uh -huh. to die for. Oh, yeah. huh? All right, that's a wrap. Give me your thoughts. It was delicious. Their sauce was amazing. I'm not a huge fan of crab, but oh, ferns, they loved it. I was gonna say, liar, liar. <laughs> <laughs> but I tried it. So, I mean, the sauce was good. I just wasn't digging the crab, but everything else, I absolutely loved. Portions were a little small. Yes, and it was very pricey. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for Hook and Real, guys. It was pretty delicious. Like Danielle said, it was pretty expensive, but we had a fun time eating there. The food was really good. The sauces were really good. We had the Hook and Real sauce. We've heard that the garlic uh, butter one is so good. So we might try that next time. 
So yeah, that's it guys. Thanks for joining. Until next time.